the local community of Middlesbrough and surrounding areas are our, our lifeline, our lifeblood. We try to give kids in Teesside an opportunity to become professional sportsmen. Something like this is just phenomenal. And Lawrence Jackson School have provided a fantastic facility for everybody um, in, in Gisborne and surrounding areas. For almost two decades, Middlesbrough Football Club have been dedicated to increasing children's love of sport and the opening of this new 3G pitch is the latest commitment to the younger generation. It's not just the, the local sports clubs of rugby and football that are buying in, but their core curriculum is encouraging the kids who you wouldn't associate with physical education and sport in general. That they're, they're buying into it and they get a buzz out of using such a, such a wonderful facility. The artificial grass pitch will be used all year round by over a thousand students and is set to increase sports participation by a staggering 84%. Local hero Ben Gibson was there to cut the ribbon and officially declare the pitch open. I was one of them stood here. I used to, I used to look up to Stuart Downing, Jonathan Woodgate. They were the homegrown lads coming through at the time, and to, to give a little bit back to be here you now to see them looking at me in that way is is, is great. It's what every kid dreams of to, to represent our our town's club, and you know hopefully get the chances to play on facilities like this. Then you never know they might join us. The project was made possible thanks to the Football Foundation with grants from the Premier League, the FA and Sport England. In the last 16 years, the Foundation and its partners have awarded over £9 million of investment into grassroots sport across the whole of the North Riding area. We've been dreaming of this for many years and pursuing it. So to have this in the heart of our community now, not just for Gisborough Town, but for Skelton Ladies, for all the local junior clubs, is absolutely brilliant. Increasing opportunities such as these will certainly encourage local communities to play for the love of sport and hopefully along the way help unearth future generations of stars.